Good evening, everybody. Welcome to a Saturday night stream of the Pink Panthers. Hope everyone's doing well and that your footy team had a win today. What's everyone been up to? Good to see a few people in chat. Dominic, Jamie, uh, Rod, welcome. First time chatter. Jacko, welcome. How are you, mate? What's going on? Uh, Rod, we're about to find out. We are about to find out. So I've I found it definitely a lot more enjoyable since the last couple of patches. I'm on Steam playing on PC, but uh, this patch tonight... Could add a little bit more excitement because I've uh, I've I've seen and heard that there's some speckies in the game, so we've got to try and nail one of those. Liam, welcome. Fear, legend, how are you going, mate? Dill, how are you? What's going on, Dom? Yeah, so have have heard of people take taking speckies. Um, we'll cover off the the, uh, the patch notes in a sec as well. So finally not sick though. That's good to hear. Good to hear. Did you fully feel fully recovered today, Jacko? Hey, Junkers. Yeah, right, it sounds and, uh, like, I suppose people have been having different experiences on Sony versus uh, PC, but um, like I said, the last couple of patches, I've, I've felt it's definitely played a lot better than it has been, but I'm, I'm very interested to see the handballing update as well, so that's going to be interesting. Father, welcome, how's it going? I hope you're doing well. Uh, that's a good call, Liam. Play Dream Time with G, that's a very good call. Let's do that. Morse, how are you? What's going on? Dylan? Uh, no, so I didn't. Yeah, didn't play footy. Had a run in the warm. Oh, that's good. At least you're out there getting some fresh air and running around. That's very good. Ah, oh, very good. I appreciate you coming over from TikTok. Thank you very much for that. Uh, Drunk has tried playing online tonight, but it's where it's worse. Really, Jesus. Socky, how are you, mate? What's going on? All right. Should we chat about the? Um, we'll chat about the patch notes. Let me. Close that. Uh, let's go to the game. Okay, so the patch notes. Oh, Swans Lawson just got COVID. Oh, shit, combustion. That's a pretty average day all around. Hope you're feeling better, though. Did the Swannies lose today? Oh, hang on. 
I need to do one. I need to do one more thing. What were the um, the scores in the other game? Artie Jones had a cracker. Oh, very good. Okay, so let's chat patch notes quickly. So the patch notes come out earlier on tonight. Uh, it was about a two gig update, roughly. So one of the, I suppose, bigger ones, if we want to call it that for some time. So the patch notes are as follows. Smothers have been added. So I, I think people have definitely seen the animation where the AI kicks the ball and you intercept it, essentially. That, that's not actually a smother. That's more of an interception or a bit of a botched kick. Um, so I'm not sure if that's a glitch or not or if that's how it's meant to play out but that's yeah I, I think that's more of an interception so smothers are now in the game which I believe is R1 from memory uh, improved handball on the run that's the one I'm looking forward to seeing how that handles improved I, I've actually found the handball on the run to be okay sometimes it doesn't hit this the right direction which is probably the thing I'm looking at at it improving so you're hitting where you want it to go more often than not which would be good uh, improved AI positioning I'm thinking this is going to be in relation to the team that we control because quite often all your defenders get caught out in the worst positions on counter attacks and you get scored against easily so I'm thinking that's what it's in relation to uh, improvements to various user interface elements so there wasn't really any elaboration on that piece so I'm not too sure what that will actually entail uh, Das Blues welcome uh, combustion, I oh, appreciate that. Yeah, wet toast. I'm, I'm definitely going to try and do a specky. Does anyone, has anyone had any, any success? And is there, is there a specific button combination, or is it just a little bit of timing? I'm kind of thinking, I'm thinking that it's probably going to be more likely if it's a player that's running into the contest to mark it, not standing still. Um, that's just my initial thought, but I don't know. I don't know if there's anything to do that. Position and timing, yeah, yeah. So we'll give it a whirl, though. We're going to play, good call, we're going to play the Dreamtime of the G game because that is coming up this week. Um, we'll change it. Uh, we'll, we'll go genuine to it. We'll go to the G. We'll make it a night game. Uh, night. <clears throat> Four color yellow showers. Auto wind is on. Hardest three and a half minutes. Yep, I'm a tiger supporter. Definitely a tiger supporter. The difficulty for me on management mode is wait. Okay, so that's that's interesting, Dust Blues, because I'm I'm literally hitting this. I actually had a game on hardest on management the other day, and I I did okay on it. I think I won quite comfortably, but then the three games after it, I really struggled. So I'm not sure I'm not sure what's happening there. Did we go to school together, Rod? This is interesting. Actually, were you the person who commented on my TikTok asking about HP? Were we in the same year level? Uh, um, uh, so, yeah, we're going to try and take a spec. I think that's obviously the aim of tonight. G'day, Brody. Primary and high school. Okay. I don't want to dox each other by saying surnames, so we can maybe work that out uh, offline, though, potentially. Oh, my stream looks a little bit laggy on my laptop. Not sure if it's happening on anyone else's. On my screen playing, it's fine. Yeah, it is a little bit, isn't it? Oh, okay, nice, nice. No, they definitely didn't say in the patch notes. No, I won't hold that against you. I won't hold that against you. They definitely didn't say in the notes that Speckies were out, but people have um, been having success in taking the Speckies. He ran into a brick wall. That didn't travel far enough. Kicks to space. Closed him down. They bottled it up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yep. Yeah. I know who you are now. Yep. I won't. The winner there. What's been happening to you, mate? What have you been doing with yourself? Long time. Defense 101 there. Perkins. Is Craig McRae still not in? Really? He hasn't kicked it very punch this. Oh, don't rush it. Oh, I would have actually been better rushing that, wouldn't I? That's a bit of a freebie. You can't afford to turn the ball over like that. So, I think most coaches are back, though, aren't they, uh, Jordan? 
I saw. I, I know in my management mode, I've got. I've got a a dimmer with a full head of hair. Sets a task for the forwards. Ridley oh, tries to spike it There's still no McRae. He's probably one that's not been in there for a little while, isn't he? Oh, Jesus. Throw him. Well, Stewie Jew, another one that wasn't in there. Okay, I didn't realise that Stewie Jew wasn't in. I should have rushed the Jacko. I was a little bit worried that I would get done for deliberate, but if I had have paid attention maybe to the actual rules, that, that would have been deemed under pressure and I should have been allowed to, I suppose. So we're trying to see here a couple of things. If the handball is improved... Oh, I got out of position there. Because there's meant to be some handballs improved. Oh, no, I take your word, Jordan. I take your word. I just haven't used... I probably haven't used Collingwood in a, in a management sense, so uh, I hadn't, hadn't seen it. Difficulty's too easy for Brody. Need to bump it up. Well, I think... Um, it's definitely very choppy on my screen. I don't know why, if I'm having some upload issue... It's definitely not that choppy in gameplay, I promise you. Um, yeah, so Hardest is meant to be getting bumped up to be a lot harder very shortly. I imagine that means oh, other game mode, other levels will get a bit of a... Oh, a bit of a nerf as well. Jesus, two goals down. I can play it. We can use Collingwood next, Jordan. Let's, have, let's check it out. But out of interest, though... Do you, are you, is McRae showing up in the play now mode? Is it just management that he's not showing? Because I've, I've noticed that um, before it was fixed, for, or for Dimmer anyway, that he was showing in play now but not in management. So it'd uh, be interesting to see if that's sort of similar for yourself or if it's not showing for either. Squeeze that. Yeah, it's good, Morris. The game will be cross-play. The game will be cross-play. It's not at the moment, I don't think. I think that's coming uh, later in the week. Wind. I don't think wind's in the game yet, Dust Blues. That's coming by end of the week as well. But what is in the game that's made goal-kicking harder is the timing bar. So the second part of your goal-kicking action, you now have to actually get it in the blue. So previously, you, kind of had, you could kind of cheat it a bit by stopping it before the blue so you wouldn't risk spraying it. Uh, and it would just go straight, but now you have to actually stop it in the Both right the right timing zone. So, it's a great contest. but yeah, wind Creeper will be will be coming and will affect kicks. Well played. He'll be annoyed by that. Oh, I probably should have marked that. Center, Parrish is there in the clinches. Alarm bells are ringing. Searching kick. Oh, I've lost this. So shit. Strong one on one. Straightforward, you would think. Yeah, I don't know what she's. I don't know what she's doing out there. I don't think she's actually doing anything. Um, so, Deck, we're not sure on the speckies yet. Not too sure. It's, good for it's mainly when it's like an up-close shot. Is it soccer or is it all the time? Because I had a quick look. In general play, it looked okay. But yeah, speckies, I'm thinking, is going to be a bit of a timing thing and trying to get someone running up at the... Had some assistance. Martin. He put himself oh. in the line of fire. Plenty of heat in this game. Kicking for his first. Spud ah. would have loved that one. On PS4 management mode, this stop. Still no crowd. Yeah, so Das Blues, Ross was explaining last night that um, it's to do with the PS4 frame rates, um, which is why the crowd's been a little bit of an issue. So I know that they're obviously aware of it. Oh! Jesus! Oh, but it's play on! No! Why? Took a specky and it was play. I don't know what I did, but it was. I don't know why it was play on though. That's annoying. That's a bruising tackle. Zerk Thatcher can send them into attack. Goes laterally. Redmond. Yeah, how do I do that? Is it the interactive replay? Or am I too far back? Oh, there you go. You took it, but it was cool to play on. Has to be a sign, McSpar. That is all you. But I don't know... I, I don't know why it didn't count, though. Like, it... Um, it made me play on straight away. So that's a bit annoying. Has anyone else had the same experience? Has anyone taken a specky and it's just been play on? Pretty cool animation, though. 
They're up and about, but the challenge will come. It's time for some observations. If we can, yeah, if we can make sure they're paid marks, that'd be that'd be lovely. It feels like this game is there for the taking. And yeah, it was interesting though because they didn't actually announce that Speckies were in. I would have thought that would have been something you would flag uh, with your patch notes or whatever. But thanks, Gary. As we get going again, Grimes spoils. Oh, right. Can he get a shot away? Jesus. Gets it out of the oh, if we can zone. keep this in here, we could be away. Rioli sets up a oh, that was a race. smother attempt Pick by the AI. It. Didn't everyone see that? He's everywhere at the moment. Prestia. This is good footy. Bolton finds himself unattended. Into the pocket he goes. Laverde. Red oh, red shit. Red. I thought I had that. See something he likes. What are the dogs win by, Pef? I missed that. McGrath. Um, so for tackles, I, uh, well, for marking, I think I was only holding triangle. I mean, I usually do t for marks, but I don't know if I was holding any other button or not. I don't think I was. First back, yeah, good clipping. Well done. Are we playing on Xbox when it comes out? Yeah, nice. I think, um, like, as shit as this whole situation's been for Xboxes, I really think that it's going to be... A big benefit that you're going to end up with a, a pretty clean game to start with compared to what uh, what we had, which is good. He's off. His field kicking is normally oh first gosh, rate. it is Ball out in a lot of space. Um, so, Mido, to download the update, you just have to you should just have to open your Steam essentially, and then as soon as I open mine, as long as the game is set on like automatic update. Um, uh, yeah, it started to update straight away. It only took a few minutes because it was only 2 gig. Oh, I forgot to say that before. Sorry, guys. So, this patch that's come out tonight for Steam and any other patches that come out tomorrow, um, yeah, tomorrow as well, play, uh, PlayStation users will get all of that in one patch on Monday. So, you won't actually get it over the weekend. And that's because with the way the submission piece works with Sony, they're actually obviously being in office. They're closed on the weekend, um, so there's no one there to actually approve it and push it through for you. So it's not that people don't want you to have it, it's just that um, they are, I suppose, essentially a 9 to 5 run operation wherever they are, and they won't, they won't be able to push it through for you. G'day Jessa, welcome, hope you're doing well. But yeah, so you should have got the patch from last night today, though, he I think. Um, he has produced a clinical finish there to cap off so the patch, I'll read it out again. Welcome, Bailey. Uh, the patch. The patch for tonight is added smothers, improved handball on the run, improved AI positioning, and improvements to various UI elements. Whatever, whatever that means. I suppose that's more menu option related, I guess. So this is on Hardest, and again, I'm still finding Hardest to have a, a good degree. Oh! Nah, it's a, the spec is good, but it's broken because it's not being paid a mark. That's annoying. You take hangers, and it's you don't get to take your kick. We'll have to flag that. Because that really takes away from the whole, the whole thing. Good penetration on the kick. The interchange bench might be calling after that blue. Martin kicking for his first. Nice ball through. With the big fist. Gets it to safety. Well, Speckies are technically there, Bailey, but it's not counting as a mark, so. He's off. Um, I suppose. Oh, I took, that was on me. I took way too long to kick that as a tour. That was still. Is that any better? Uh, well, like I've said, I've found the last two updates to have changed the gameplay dramatically for me on Steam, but I acknowledge that some people maybe haven't felt the same on uh, Sony. But it's definitely, like, you're able to put together handball chains and shit like that now, so that's that's mu a much improved um, from what, what we usually had. Now you've got to time your shots a bit better for goal, which is good too. I'm still waiting for the win to take effect, though. That piece hasn't fully come in just yet. Shea's snuck that one in. 
up the pair. Probably too early, Mika. This is only my first game on the on the new patch. Speckies are definitely in there. They're just not being paid as a mark. So I've taken two. I don't know how. I can't actually tell you how I did it. Um, the animation completed the mark, but when I hit the ground, it was play on both times. So that was a bit annoying. They definitely need to ensure that Speckies are paid as the mark. Yeah, that's right, Fia. It's um, it's the C word that everyone's, I suppose, most annoyed about. I think the gameplay, for me, the gameplay has gotten to a point where it's it's definitely playable um, and enjoyable most of the time too. It's now just making sure the stability piece works okay. And there's still, and I don't want people to confuse it. There's still definitely other things they've got to improve and tweak for gameplay. But I'm just saying, in comparison to what we had at launch, you can definitely play this and definitely have a bit of fun with it um, at a minimum. Oh, the um, changing off your player on the mark seems to work better. I was able to change the two different players then first time quite easily, so that's nice because that was a big issue as well. That was annoying. That's good vision. The Bombers have winners everywhere. He's off. The Tigers oh, are chasing tail. You reckon, Des Blues, what, what tackling issues are you still finding? Just not being able to do it or it's or they're evading it too easy? Ah, uh, the Bonding, the Brown... Oh, I don't know. It's looking every bit of blow out at this stage. I mean, the Bond's such an impactful player, isn't he? Like, he can change the game so quickly. He's just a beast. Can he be the Oh, we got Lee. The Tigers are just hanging in there. The margin, I know, I know Perfect's getting out of hand. I'm going to try and pull one back here. The problem, this is the problem on three and a half minute quarters. I don't actually give myself enough time. Uh, still can't tackle much. Okay. I mean, if it's on hardest, I kind of don't mind if the AI are busting through tackles every now and then. You don't want it to be excessive and you want to be able to still stick the tackles you need to stick, I suppose, don't you? Oh, that can't be 15. Oh. in some space now. Bangs it long. Can we spoil it over? Ah, yep. oh, throwing shit. Gaz, what's got your I know, um, Kassa, I know online is, is definitely glitchy and buggy as, so uh, I even I played one last Perfect. night and it was... It was um, a goal scoring opportunity soccer for a quarter, which wasn't very good. Yeah, the moment they can sort of have... The online gameplay mirror what we get offline, I think, will be will be huge. It will make it so much better. G'day, Caps. Going well, thanks yourself, Puppy Panther. Yeah, tactics interchange are definitely going to be in it very, very soon. I'm actually a little bit surprised if they weren't in today's one, if I'm being honest. Oh, no, he smothered it. Wins a hardball. Merit. This is a That's annoying. Good, but annoying. Yeah, huge. And I'm a little bit thinking that as well sometimes. Like, it's hard because, like, a lot of people can. It's, it's like, but what's the, the difference? Why, why do some struggle and some don't? I'm, I'm kind of a little bit lost as to why. It could be a combination of all the above, though, really. Yeah, Tactics Dash Blue should be this weekend or Monday at worst. So maybe tomorrow. I, yeah, like I said, I thought we were going to see it tonight, but... Um, obviously, oh, obviously wasn't to be. Martin. Kick that, Dusty. Ah. Good vision there, Kelly. Gets his kick despite the heat. Ridley uses oh, the body well. Try to get a specky there. Didn't the know what I was doing. But... What a game he's having, Heppel. I need tactics. My players aren't there. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's right. They don't. They don't sort of zone back or do anything with any kind of purpose, do they? Which is um, annoying. It uh, it does make a difference, especially when their AI are playing with the tactics. Um, so they're obviously running to better in different positions than what our players are. Oh no, I muffed the timing on that massively. That's what they call a good old fashioned clanger. G'day Morse, welcome. Uh, so the patch 
Sorry there, Ian. The patch for tonight was added smothers, improved handball on the run, improved AI positioning, improvements to various UI elements. Smothers are in the game. Uh, I've seen the AI attempt two on me so far. Um, so I reckon... Is it R1, I think? Uh, Fleema, possibly. I mean... It would make it would make sense because I don't think it would be fair if if we had a leg up on Xbox users for Pro Team, um, just with the way the game mode works. And I think if we're being realistic as well, given that it's going to be an online game mode, I actually think they've got to get that online piece fully sorted as well before it launches. Otherwise, it'll be chaotic. So I'm I'm kind of feeling a bit like as much as I'd love to have it, um, I would rather online get fully sorted as well. Hopper wins the contest hands down. Not a lot of positives today. Bolton sees something he likes. Here's a big chance to pick back the Oh, do we hit? Yeah, we got to hit Dusty here. Martin has charged. Get it inside to the great man. Yeah, I think I'm cooked here, Pef. I think I'm cooked. Oh, Dusty's kick meter still goes quick, but he still slots it. I don't know if they are, like the testing that I've done probably doesn't stack up as much as I maybe thought. So I don't know whether they'll just random one-off occurrences or not, but um, yeah, it was definitely weird. Cumberland! Come on, Noah. Keep ourselves with half a chance here. Oh. No, I didn't go to the game, Smitty. Didn't go. I was um, we we're doing a lot of last-minute Mother's Day stuff. So, did you get along? Yeah, wind will definitely be added in. It'll be. I'm hoping it's going to be similar to what the um, PlayStation users had for the mini game with uh, Dangerfield at the start. Probably not tomorrow night, being. It's going to be a big day, Mother's Day wise, for us, so probably not. We might be. I know. I don't want to say anything, Pef. We might be on. Smashes it out of there. Taranto. Pick it. He's kicked it high. Oh. Lynch. Squeezes the kick. Zerk Thatcher. Chops it off. Good tackle. Pick it up. Jackie Boy. We are on, folks. We are on. It's a gift, really. Speckies are in, Dommy. Welcome, firstly. Speckies are on. Did that not give me score? Oh, uh, Jade one back. Um, I don't know how to do Speckies, Dommy. The only issue we've got with them at the moment is... It, the animation works well and you come down with the ball having Hopper taken a mark but it's not actually paying it like as soon as you hit the ground it's um play on so that's a bit annoying so you're not actually getting rewarded for your for your speckies wins the contest and can relieve the pressure Grimes can keep it moving probing ball Floston has found some space at halfback the Tigers oh shit I need to kick that in the air didn't I I need to put that over him that's poor kicking that might attract a pack Ridley should be in the votes today. The defenders will be nervous. You can't question his commitment. It's on. Gotta spoil that. Ah, uh, it was that Tarrant. Gets to the drop and they'll get the goal in the end. Ah, uh, so Jordan, for goals. for the marking, I've definitely found that hitting triangle as your controller vibrates is definitely helping. Um, it's definitely letting me mark a few more. But yeah, hopefully, hopefully that does the same thing for others. But um. I suppose because they've increased the AI. Maybe not the difficulty, but just the sort of little, yeah. With all the little gameplay tweaks. Oh, got a handball. Same as spoiling. So I wouldn't mind that recovery time to be just a fraction quicker. Ridley, accuracy and distance might both be oh, here. That's unlucky. Like Drop Taron for Gibby. Oh, I know. Desperately need uh, Gibkis back in minute. real life. They need to make sure Speckies are balanced. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Nah, no fights, Pef. No fights. Well, I had a little mini comeback of sorts there, but 
haven't been able to hold on ultimately. They're moving the footy quickly. Martin Perkins can run, and that's a great hand pass. Going for goal, flirting with the post. Uh, oh, at the post. He's missed a couple now. Um, Morse, I think, um, I think gameplay-wise, it's ahead of the build before, like, the submission build. It's definitely ahead. But the submission build still had other things in it that this didn't. So things like the wind was working well, all the coaches' heads and everything that were in the game. So, yeah, there was definitely bits and pieces that were still in the submission build that, um, that aren't featuring here yet. But gameplay-wise and the movement and stuff like that is is definitely, I, th I think, definitely better than the submission build. And there's still obviously more improvements to come um, because in the submission build, there wasn't tactics or anything in there either. So I, I can't really compare on that front. Um, all right, well, we'll try we'll try the management game. Who have we got? We've got the Saints. G'day, Robo. Welcome, mate. Uh, not too sure, to be honest. I've seen... We were able to do two speckies, but they're not paid as marks. So as soon as you hit the ground, it's it's play on. So that's a little bit annoying. Oh, Flim, I forgot. I'll track him in the next one. We'll do another one. Yeah, so it's... Um, speckies are actually... Yeah, speckies are in wood. I don't know. I don't know what the if there's a button combination, if it's a timing thing or a bit of both. Hello, but like I said before, it's not actually registering as a mark. Yeah, the animations look awesome. They do look good, but they just need to make sure that it. Yeah, it's actually given as a mark. I don't know why it's so choppy on the stream. Like I promise you that playing it is running smoothly. It's not as choppy as what it maybe looks on some of your screens. VFL teams, David, not just yet. It is imminent though. So state league teams is imminent, tactics is imminent, wind and footedness difficulty is imminent. Um, the difficulties for like hardest and everything is being jacked up a bit. That's coming very soon as well. So it's all. It's going to be interesting to see what comes out tomorrow. I'll try. I'll do my best, Robo, to do a specy. They do look pretty cool. So there's meant to be some a better handballing in the game as well. Ralph Smith takes an excellent grab. He's off. Kicks to space. Cumberland. Delivers a long ball. Punched away. Oh, I punched it. And we'll have a throw in. Gary Lyon is here. Gaz, what are your thoughts on what we've seen so far? Yeah, Roxas, I think I can understand that. I think once you get all these patches dropped in, though, you'll, you'll definitely have a, uh, a much more enjoyable experience than... What was had previously? Yeah, that's what I mean. If it was bit rate or if it was, yeah, if it was something on my end that it would, um, it would probably be everything that was jittery, not just the gameplay. So I'm not sure. I'm not sure why it's just doing it there. Yeah, Miko, I'm actually not too sure. I didn't ask a follow-up question on that, so I, I was interested to read and hear about it. That. Yeah, that would be cool if there's that left and right foot in this. Oh, God. Timing meter. Not yet, Robbo. Second game for the night. Morse used to reckon the handball needs needs work. What are you um, What are you thinking in, in what aspect? How far is he run? Oh. Oh, there's a specky. But it's play on. On centre wing. Look at the space he's got to work with. Cumberland. Through the centre square he goes. Searching kick. Riola is the man on the spot. Everyone see that one? The, you know, the speck in the middle there? Should be a goal. But, yeah, not pay to mark. So that's the part they've got to fix. Drop punt and he has pulled away. It doesn't matter who you are. It's always good to get an early one. Oh, yeah. So when you're close to the boundary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get what you mean. Well, so I've had that happen too. Like, it's like, even though you're... Holding your the control or aiming at a certain camp. player, it just kind of disregards it. Most yeah, I know, it is a, it is a reasonable kick clash there. Cool under Turnover in the middle. Oh, this but if he hit a target, hit Tommy Lynch on that hit. 
Uh, put it this way, my mate watched me play day one. He was laughing at how bad it was and kept saying it's rubbish. At least the money wants to buy it. Yeah. Oh, it, it's definitely um, it's definitely playable now. Like I said, it's still a long way to go and more things to improve. But compared to day one, huge difference. Goals have been tough to come by. Got to make the most of your opportunities. Got to stop this one, Jackie boy. Oh, good work on the clipping. I think I'm liking that even though it's not paid as a mark, I'm liking the speckies aren't happening all the time. Um, so it will actually, when they're paid, will feel really ex like you'll be genuinely excited by it. Especially if it's like late in a game and you clutch one uh, and you take a huge specky with a few seconds to go. That'd be kind of cool. Jones, well done. Stack, fighting hard. Billings. Kicks inside the forward 50. Good discipline defence. Rioli. Nancurvis. What can he do with it? Hopper. Out of the congestion. Cumberland. Oh, get rid of it, Cumberland. Of the umpire says he had no yeah, Mendel, welcome. Playing on hardest. Yep, playing on hardest. This is uh, a management career game. Nancurvis we just tried to play now game it. first, and that was all okay. Taranto so now trying... Um, Lays it off. Lynch. This for oh, now trying try. career. Lynchy boy, you just turn and go. How have Sony players found it with the, since the patch from the other night? Has anyone found much improvement? Oh, Jesus, just got there, the big dusty. Uh, on hardest, Morse, on hardest. Uh, I think I've aimed this too far left. And his kick meter goes really quick for some reason. Yeah, that's a mongrel. Did that just... What happened to the ball there? It's like it hung in the air for Jack and did something weird. Oh no, it just floated to him. Okay, fair enough. Dusty's a walking goat, absolutely, Captain. Uh, Aiden, this might be controversial, but I think the awful launch of this game has lowered people's expectations standard too much. Imagine if we could reach released a game that didn't have interchanges, tackles, win. He's went even in the game, he set the wind. I understand that, Aiden, but all that is is a theory. And it's not the actual reason because I played a game, like the, the submission kit was more advanced than what we had at launch. So there was a version of the game already better than what was at launch, which validates to me that it was just a complete fuck up. Like something bad happened that shouldn't have. Um, and I don't think it was delay tactics at all because like I said, I, I, I played a version and you all saw it. And you saw Twisty's video, Kados's video, my videos. It was all better gameplay than what we had at launch. So that sort of verifies there was a version of the game at some point that was still better than what we had at launch. But I don't disagree with you. Like it's, it's definitely tarnished reputation. It's definitely um, cause for concern. And, and it, yeah, you definitely wouldn't want it to happen again. So there better be some good learnings from it. But I think the reasons as to why are, are valid and aren't. They were, there was nothing sinister behind it. It was just really poor how, how it went. Really poor. The Saints are already chasing tail. They've got a lot of work ahead of them to make a game of... 32 to 5 marks against on AI. Are you doing it... Oh, it's like a dim with hair. Are you hitting it with the... Um, when it's vibrating? I found that's helped, helped heaps. Bought it on Sting yesterday. Oh, that's interesting, the wood, because... That seems to be one of the things that people are sort of saying feel different, is that the gameplay on PlayStation versus PC. And Ross was obviously in here the other day saying it's all... All the same build. So that's interesting that you feel it's the same. I haven't picked up my PlayStation pre-order yet. Oh, shit. Oh, Jesus. Come just said that was a goal. Don't think so. Away he goes. Taranto. Run on, run on. See something he likes. Cochin. They might be out here. Their ball movement has been impressive. Cumberland. What a game he's having. Rioli. That was good little chip it down the ground. Okay, that's interesting, Jordan. Uh, so console players are saying there's still shit. You reckon it's a skill issue? Look, my only other thought on that is so sock puppet is 
in this track this quite a bit. A um, at the post, I would say he well is a better a player of games than I am. Good. And if he was, if he's struggling with it, then I, I that makes me believe that there is a bit of a he's difference. Off. But he has said in recent Tony times it has felt a lot better. He's hit up but um, takes the no, no, I mean, can you input steal. plays like defence? Not yet. Not so when the so tactics far. come in, um, I mean, I don't know what all the tactics will be, but you'll be able to do things on the fly as well. So I, I'm guessing that means on the D pad, you able to have like, I'm hoping it's something as simple as off, like attack, defend, all out attack, all out defend, something simple like that would be good. Uh, camera angle for this one is side far with a camera height at 44, um, which I've found to be, I don't know why, I think it was, I was trying to do 45 and I couldn't get it there, so I just stuck with 44, but what's everyone else been feeling camera, camera wise? Just tell him it's a skill issue. That's good vision. Hey, text man, welcome. What's he got on offer? Can't take it. Grow yeah, what's everyone else been using for their cross. cameras? And I've seen a few people talking Bottom. about using end to end a bit as well. Season if anyone's had luck with that. They've had the better of the contest to this point. Lynch keeps it low. Cumberland, oh. Bolton. Short kick there. At his first, and he's got Get in. End close, like side dynamic. Oh, what's everyone? How's how do you find the dynamic? Yeah, I agree, Morse. The swivel envy is the best. Yeah, I I did try end, and I'm, I'm sure a lot of you who were tuning in earlier, for early streams would have noticed. Um, but I I do struggle with the with the swivel piece. I just kind of lose orientation of where my players are, and um, I, I end up getting myself out of position. But from being able to see what you're kicking to down the field, it was very, very good. Very good. Uh, Wood bloke plays end to end because always, yeah. So yeah, people who do um, play 2K will obviously, you know, have the benefit of getting used to that, I guess. Who's front and center? You can't question his. Ah, front and center. Good driving by them. I like the lower and zoomed out kind of 2K style. Yeah, okay, yep. Got the glitch. Is that online, Mido? Is that online? And can we get to enjoy... Okay, you can enjoy the graphics more too. Uh, so, Texman, I reckon it's going to be three, is my guess. Three will come through on Monday. And the crowd's very quiet. That's the first I've heard of uh, crowd being quiet. What ground are you playing at? Oh, Jesus. King with half a chance. No. He's got it. Career mode it's Chief happened. It so when you can just soccer it only, um, Mido, just soccer only. Because I've actually noticed in some of the games when, oh, there was a smother. Did everyone see that? Watch the smother. There you go. Not bad. And passing. Kicks inside the forward 50. Defense 101 there. Ross, Wood, Ralph Smith. Desperate to win it back. He's been busy so far. Nan Curvis. Pick it. Oh, we are out here. We've got to hit a target though. First entry for a while. Yes. Lynch. Great hands there. The Tigers. Tip for first goal to score. Oh, Saints versus Crows. Let's go. Rochelle. Is he playing this week? Surely. Um, g'day, Iso. Um, I mean, it still plays... Oh, my God. Why is that? Why was that shanked so badly? It still plays as well as it has the other couple of nights. Speckies are in now, but they don't get paid as a mark, so that's a bit of a bummer. Um, I just had a smother before, which I just showed the replay of, so that was kind of cool. That, that impacted the kick. No idea what button I pressed to do it. Um, and one of the other patch notes were handball chains were improved. I, I can't say I've noticed too much of a difference on that, but I've also not felt like I've had any issues with it in previous games either, except for the odd one going out of bounds despite the direction I'm holding it in. But outside of that, it's usually been pretty good for me. So, oh, we're tackling. Set shots are, yeah. Um, so the timing meter is probably the the bit that's that means something now. So you can't just um, 
you can't just leave it in the blue and Good luck catching you know him. or a bit before the blue and you'll just kick the goal you actually have to oh, you actually have to get it in the blue and time it properly now and wind is coming as well so it's not actually wind affected just yet but that is that is coming oh is that right you've had the oh my god slice that too do I think Richmond are back? Um, a cautious Essendon supporter here. Yeah, there's a few of them around, I think. Look, it's it was a good win against Long. I was not expecting it. I'll I'll put my hand up first and foremost and say that I didn't didn't think we'd get anywhere near him. But whether we're back, I mean, you got to see it over extended period, don't you? I mean, to be fair, that's the first four quarter game we've played in maybe two years. Not even joking. Um, other than that, we would usually play one or two quarters but those quarters would be elite and that's been the frustrating part is that we've known that if we can put together even three quarters um that we would beat most teams so we just haven't been doing it so are we back not sure if i'd say that i'd want to see it again against your mob um before i'd start getting carried away with that i think but uh, it should make it for a good game though they can smell victory uh, speckies, yes, have had speckies. They're not being paid as marks though, so the animation completes and you come down with the ball, but it's instantly play on, which is a little bit annoying because it really takes away from the whole thing. Oh, he spoiled it. Yeah, Mantle was good. His job, his job that he did on Tom Stewart was really, really good. And I think Noah Bolter, take a bow. Like, I thought Hawkins was going to eat him up for breakfast. But... Away he goes. That's an aggressive I know, Craig. Well, Sock Puppet was trouble. telling me the other day that it's, we've he beaten you the last 14 the games in a row. That's crazy. Yeah, AI, I, so AI, AI positioning it was another improvement on the patch. I, I can't really say I felt I've noticed it. Maybe I don't know what I'm looking for either, but... I have like the the other the opposition have still gotten out the back uh, relatively easy on turnover and things like that. So I think for that one, I'd like to uh, maybe understand a bit more context around what that means and how it's in, like impacted in the game, just so I know what we're looking out for. Because I don't, I'm not just not sure what was meant by it. I mean, it it kind of reads self-explanatory, but maybe it's not. Three goals straight, and he's certainly making the most of his opportunities. My name is Colfi. Kakas, that's good news, isn't it? Welcome, Kakas. Uh, Colfi, doesn't... Where was that from? Still struggling the tackle, text man. Uh, the only, the only tips I can give for tackling is make sure you're letting go of sprint and hold triangle. But depending on the difficulty you're playing on, it is hard. Like, on hardest, they do... I find the AI ping the ball around a lot quicker than what I can, which means it's, it's actually harder to tackle them. If they can get the next one, it'll be on. Taranto. Up and under. Bolton. He's already got Bolton. Now he's got two. Oh, thank you for the follow, Brad. Hope everyone's doing well tonight. What's everyone's thoughts on the double header Friday night game? That was a bit of a doozy, I reckon. Not sure, not sure why they did that. Oh, I ran. ran away. And we need to have more drossling in the game too. The big drossler. Sydney stack. Wow. Okay. No worries, Stack Man. He's got two now, and I need to put more thought into stopping him. Oh yeah, Kankers, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember, I remember. About the boxing. <laughs> yeah, I remember. How are you, mate? You going well? This work is registered as a mark. Patch everyone dealing with the new patches that somehow has unlocked mechanics. That's an interesting point. It would be interesting to know what, um, good roving too. That's not a like how, how implementing a patch works and if it can undo or redo stuff or what the go is. He's got Stacks, is he in trading? Is that right, Marvos? Right so in WA or here? Probably WA, I imagine. 
You can't punch the ball. Oh, I'm, I love the spoil button. I reckon the spoil has been one of the greatest features. Oh, God. Went too far there. Good one, Nank. Sees an opportunity and plays on. Taranto working hard Just and presenting. Hit, hit our targets. Oh shit. Didn't look at the clock. Broken code original the patch. Again, mind, yeah, exactly. And I suppose, Andy, that um I suppose and that's why these all these things being added back on has come out so I, I don't want to say slowly because it's not to have this many patches in this short amount of time frame is actually quite quick all things considered um, but the reason why I suppose we haven't been able to get it all in one hit is because they've got to pick it apart bit by bit and make sure that they don't what they put back on doesn't crash again so that's probably the hard part he won't be happy with that one outbodies his opponent still doing the boxing. The refs are still jibbing you. Jesus, some likes. things don't change. Uh, Paddy Malone, I do remember seeing that someone flagged the, the clock thing with Ross, and he said it was also something he wants to see, and he asked J&T began to note it to uh, flag with the team. So I don't know what that means in terms of correlation on when and if we see that, but it's something he definitely wants as well. One of the reasons. How many, uh, I think you'll get three Robbo on the Monday. Marshall, oh, you're making some music, Hakers. What kind of music? What genre are you making? That could be a goal saving tackle. Just as they were looking dangerous, they've coughed it up. Short. That's why we so can get well. patches daily. The yeah, that's right, Andy, because they've already. And that's what I mean. Like, that's kind of my counter argument to people who think the game wasn't ready. Because you don't have all the shit that they've just put back in there. He's a quality. You don't just make that from scratch in a week, two weeks. Like, they clearly had it all there ready to go. They just had to pick it apart a bit, strip it back, and put it back in slowly, making sure it doesn't crash again. Um, so, yeah. I, Oasis, yeah. Well, Brody, you beat the Lions by four in a thriller after the siren. Good ruck work. Pick it. Yeah, exactly right, Andy. Exactly right. Uh, Favourite Pies player? I think, I mean, it's... He ran into a brick wall. I mean, the obvious answer is Dacos, isn't it? But I don't, I don't want to say that. Um, I actually, Marshall, palms it down. I actually Steel. like Brody Majek, believe it or not. I think he's one of the hardest so matchups as an opposition, like uh, from an opposition standpoint, because he's such a good size. He can mark, uh, and he's very good at, at ground level as well. And he's someone that I've always thought that we should go. Like I would have loved for us to go after. But um, probably could never fit him in, I dare say. But I've always liked, yeah, my check. I always think he's been. Maybe I'm wrong by saying he's underrated because maybe he's rated by other other clubs. But I suppose I've never really heard a lot of other people talk about him in the same kind of um, you know sentences as like your Elliots or your Dugowie's side bottoms, things like that. Favorite Crows player. Um, even though he's only really new to the club, I really like Isaac Rankin. He's just got, he's one of those players that people are going to go to the game to watch because he can, um, he can change the game. I don't know why he's running a bit backwards there. Yeah, Rankin, Rankin's pretty cool. The only thing I d don't like about him is he's, he's got to work on his defensive stuff, I think. Um, but offensively, he, he is a freak. This to seal it. Poor Hawks player. Hawks player. Um, I do... Sicily's one of those ones that... He's another one of those players that you'd love to have on your team. Hate playing against him because he, he does some dumb shit though. If he can clear that part up, he would obviously take his game a lot further. But I think John Newcomb's probably the one that I enjoy watching. It's more, it's a little bit to do with his story as well, I guess. Like coming into the, it was the mid-season draft um, from the VFL. It just sort of shows that if you work hard enough at the lower levels and you get your crack, you can make it work. So John Newcomb, I think, is a, is a wonderful story with, um, yeah, with how he's gone about it. And it was just so seamless. Like... You wouldn't know he was out. He was an, you know, a, a VFL player from the you know second week he was in there. He was just killing it. Uh, Bulldogs player. I mean, you can't go past the bond, can you? Oh shit, handball that. Aaron Norton's good when he gets going as well. 
Uh, we, I know we've made Aaron Norton look like Wayne Carey a couple of times. I've got a, a big soft spot for Toby McLean because I played um, outdoor He's cricket on. with him for quite a few Martin. years. We put on a 121-run partnership in a semi-final, and I've never he run so many men. threes in all my life, and he was almost lapping me. I mean, he, I'm obviously not that big of an athlete uh, compared to Tobes, but uh, yeah, that was, that was quite a thrill playing playing uh, some cricket with Toby. Uh, well, I, I'm a Celtic supporter, Miko, so I'm very keen for the Celtics to get through. I mean, we shouldn't even be at Game 7. We should have... We lost a game in overtime. Um, we should have had this wrapped up by now, but Philly have been playing well. So I'm working from home on Monday, which is good, but I'll uh, be definitely keeping... Definitely be keeping a close eye on that game, so hopefully the Celtics can get up. What about, what's everyone's thoughts on Miami getting through? What a shock that was. Like, they've played a whole extra round in the wildcard thing, and they've knocked off the Bucks and now the Knicks. It's crazy. Would you rather never be able to watch AFL again, or be able to watch AFL, but you've got to go for Collingwood? <laughs> uh, oh. That is a tough one. In its current format, I think I'd be okay having to watch Collingwood because I really do like McRae and Leper and what they've done. Prior to that, maybe not so much. Jimmy Buckets, yeah, he is. Um, yeah, he's fucking so good. I, I don't, I don't think this is disrespectful to say, but he is carrying Miami a ridiculous amount. If it wasn't for him, my goodness. Uh, Brownie, I work in corporate sales and look after all the AFL. Uh, and leagues for all things Sharon related, all the footballs. I wasn't going to, Dale. I really wasn't going to. And then I saw that Speckies were in. I thought, no, nah, I've got to do it. How are you, Dale? Cricket. Oh, okay. What uh, what level are you playing at, Chubby? Uh, well, Denver made easy work of it, didn't they? Katie to leave the Suns already. I think the Lakers might might do okay. Yeah, did everyone see the half-court shot today in the Lakers game at, uh, on half-time, I think it was? can't remember who the player's name were, but... State level, oh, very nice. That's awesome, Jordan. Are you a batsman, bowler, or all-rounder? Nuggets in five. Austin Reeves, thank you, Austin Reeves. That was a cracking shot. Oh, very good. Connection to the player lost. We'll try again. So what's the next steps here for you, Jordan, then? Do you just got to keep doing the hard yards until you sort of get the tap on the shoulder to try, try for the next level? Uh, Dale, have had a specky, yes, but they're not paid as a mark, which is bloody annoying. Uh, NFL, Texman... Sort of. I mean, I kind of bundled everything in together. So I followed the Celtics first, right? And then by association, I ended up just sort of following... Um, go the Hawks, actually. Following the Patriots. But then I kind of felt like it was maybe a little bit too convenient because at the time that happened... Oh, how, how good are we going here with connection? That they were very good. So it probably did seem bandwagon-ish. So I probably don't super follow it hard. I'll, I'll watch any of the games that are on. Um, have been to a game, which was pretty cool, so that's a good thing to tick off the list. Very, very good atmosphere compared to AFL. Uh, yep, got two, two kids, with a third on the way, so GG's to streaming when that happens. You go for, go for the Warriors? Yeah. So do we really think that um, Durant's going to leave the Suns already, though? Surely not. Uh, NHL... NHL, I was probably more drawn to the Rangers, even though I just talked about the Boston connection. Um, but that's only because we'd been to like three Rangers games in all of our travels. So, but then I had a, yeah, I don't really follow them specifically. We had a bit of a multi-bit on that it included the Bruins. But uh, no love there either. Ah, oh, very good, Miko. We're hoping for a girl this time round. Uh, rugby, Kaka's not so much. I'll... I'll sometimes watch when it's national level, like, you know, Australia versus England or New Zealand or whatever, but not not very often 
and even same as NRL here, I mean, the logical option is to pick the Melbourne Storm, but um, yeah, I wouldn't by any stretch say that I'm a, a Storm supporter. Denver v Boston in the final. Yeah, that could be the go. Would love, would love for Boston to jag another one here. Well, say another one, just jag a, a win. Rockets best team in the league. Oh, Jalen Brown's not leaving us, is he? Can't have that. Is anyone else having a really bad or a really hard time with online? Rugby's life. I am rugby. Who's your rugby team of choice there, Cackers? But no, I don't mind watching all different sports. Even cricket. Big Bash, don't mind watching that. Just keep doing my thing before and best and hope to get picks. Yeah, nice. Do you have any... Do you have like a preference list, Jordan, as to where you would like to go? Who did you play for at local level? Sale Sharks, England, the Glasgow Warriors. Oh, very good. How are they both going there, Kakers? I follow Tottenham for EPL. So, Spurs fan. Philly fan. So, they're having nightmares about Butler. He, he's a heartbreaker. He just... Oh. Some of the shit he's been pulling out the last couple of games has been ridiculous. Oh, Wendery, nice. Johnny Brown only staying if you get... Yeah. I've always been a little bit baffled by all, how all the contracts work in the NBA and the NFL. What does everyone think about... Um, obviously, LeBron's son's going to be in the draft. I'm not sure if it's next year or the year after. And that he's pretty much... Like, LeBron has pretty much said that wherever his son gets drafted, he'll go play for a year. Like, essentially, draft tampering. Okay, so online's definitely cool to you guys. This is not going... Oh, uh, we'll do another season game. Oh, no. Management. Yeah, Miko, the Last Dance documentary is a cracker. I really, really love it. Uh, fascinating insights into how that all went. And just... Like, I can really understand... And I'm glad that MJ acknowledges it too, but you can understand why his teammates would actually hate him. Um with the way he, I suppose, conducted himself at trainings and stuff like that, but he knew that he had to do that to get the results, um, and he did. He's just unbelievably good. Uh, Dale, the State League teams are very, very close. They're, they're imminent, we've been told. Imminent. Cox won the Coleman in your career. Jesus. Oh, Vic for indoor cricket. Very good, Jordan. I've, I was a big... In, I played um, Super League and... And Major League for indoor cricket. Hello, Loved indoor Hudson. cricket, but I found that it absolutely rooted my outdoor cricket. I did indoor cricket for a lot before I really got into outdoor, but it really fucked my shot selection something fierce. It took me a long time to course correct it for outdoor cricket. Once I got it right, though, I was... Every year of my senior career in cricket, albeit I wasn't playing high levels, like the highest I played was maybe A grade or turf or whatever, um, I was able to make 100 in most years, which was good. But junior-wise, I was hit and miss because it absolutely rooted my shots. It was terrible. You reckon Brody will be a first-rounder? Yeah, hopefully, Dale. Hopefully, Monday. At worst, hopefully. hopefully. Oh, any particular one, Kakas? Any particular... Why is Dunkley captain? Maybe they've had an injury. Because it's season, it's management mode. That's the only thing I can think of. If Artie Jones had a scan, or will it let me do that in here? No, it doesn't come up. We'll check it after this. Remind me after this. But like, what a what a carrot though to to draft Ronnie to get LeBron. Like, just for jersey sales alone. You are going to make an absolute forge. Imagine all the father-son memorabilia they're going to make and just make an absolute killing on. It's going to be crazy. I mean, that's what I'd be doing if I was the club. Okay, Tiger Boy. Uh, uh, Two-part answer to that. Yes, speckies have happened in the game and yes, the animation has suggested I've taken them, but they're not actually being paid as a mark. So two times uh, it's happened and not been paid. Ah, oh, the strong fella. 
yeah, going well, thanks, mate. How about you? It is. Uh, it's going well. It's going. There's a couple. Still a few things that have to be tweaked for sure, but it's definitely, well, for me anyway, at a playable level that has have uh, definitely an element of enjoyment around as well, which is good. How about you? What's going on, Tiger Boy? Got your big freeze beanie today. Very good, King. Make sure everyone gets out and gets one of those. I saw a heap at Coles tonight. Uh, the big freeze. Get around it. Very good cause. Kicks for goal. It's a lovely looking kick. So the only thing, Dale, is I don't know. So obviously the state league teams are coming in. I just don't know in what capacity can you use them. Like, is it just play now? Can you use them in management career? Uh, Dale, uh, Dale, Ross did mention last night in the stream that um, there's essentially going to be a, a custom season mode that comes in where you can put in, like you could copy all the AFL teams across and then make or play as Tasmania, for example. Um, or and or any custom teams that's that you make too so that well, I don't know I mean that's obviously going to be another spot where you can use it but I don't know where else it's going to come in g'day Regan welcome hope you're doing well um, so the patches for tonight were I'll read it let me get this the patch notes were added smothers improved handball on the run improved AI positioning and improvements to various UI elements so I've definitely seen a couple of smothers. Um, the Lions are handballing, I, it's hard for me to say if I've noticed a difference in handballing because I've not really felt I've had an issue doing it except for the odd one that does go out of bounds when you're not, you're clearly not aiming there. Um, and I kicked that straight out in the foot. Nothing yet, Brock. Um, Ross did post today or yesterday that there's still obvious... Cameron. I suppose issues and like the, the reason why the reason why they can't speak about it, and this came from Ross's the mouth the reason why they can't McCarran. speak about it at the moment is, is due to NDAs so Microsoft have got NDAs really in place with Big Ant that if X, Y and Z happens you're not allowed to say anything until such time so that's it's not that they've forgotten about you or that they don't want to say anything they do they just actually aren't allowed to which doesn't make it any better and it's still shit for Xbox users but that's where it's at um Am I going to the Dreamtime game? It probably depends. Whose home game is it? If it's Richmond's home game, I'll try to. I should know that with the job I'm in, but I don't. Um, yeah, if it's Richmond's home game, I will try and get along to it. But if it's Essendon's home game, I won't actually be able to because my membership is home games only. That's right, Reg. All good. Going well, thanks. Yourself? Essendon's home game? Ah. I'm spewing I didn't go to bloody Friday nights. Always nice to beat the catters. In towards goal. Oh, that's a He's shit shot, Dusty. Last season was the best for me. Three tons, four half centuries in 50. Oh, shit, that's a good, that's a good season, Jordan. He's off. And they're away. Did you win any awards off the back of that? I know we don't all play for individual accolades and things like that, but did you get any of the um, averages or aggregates or anything like that? Can they find a late goal? Rainer had his name. Uh, corporate sales and AFL league stuff, buds, with like and he be sharing the in the footies. So getting all that organised for everyone. Toss, oh, Arjo, how are you, mates? What's going on, legend? Yeah, what did you think? What did you think of the game? Uh, Dale, uh, I'm enjoying the game more. Um, I'm definitely happy with how it's playing. I am also acknowledging that there's a long way to go still. There's still a lot of modes to, to come back in and a lot of things to get right um, before, you know, before you would say it's a complete success. But it's definitely taking positive steps in the right direction. And, you know, as much as we wish we weren't in this situation with the patches coming daily and it was just good from day one, I think, you know, people say what you will, but I think um, you've got to commend Big Ant on... The length and the efforts they're going to to get these patches out as quickly as it's they can um, to make this game playable again and get it in a, in a good spot. Acknowledging that it shouldn't have been there to start with, but um, it's yeah, it's definitely much more playable now for sure. For First most wickets, second most runs, and a scorecard four for an oh shit, four for an 156 not out. Damn, that is a big game. It sees them in this contest up to their eyeballs. 
Uh, so Dale, so Ross has said that even what we're playing right now still isn't what they thought was going to be out at launch. So there's still a lot more stuff that they thought was going to be, well, that should have been on the game at launch. So this still isn't at launch level yet, as far as they're concerned, which is good. Washed out to see Cotchin combined for seven goals. <laughs> Were you on uh, Koch watch as well there, Sarge? Provide some run. Touch and go. I was, I was, um, I was hoping Koch would sneak a cheeky five. I know that's asking a bit, a bit too much, but I was getting very excited at at his goal kicking. Round back the clock a bit, Kochi. Kick it. Oh, it's on the ball, I reckon. Hey Dan, what's going on? What do you think of Bolter's game, Sarge? Uh, difficulty. Well, I think, it, I don't know, like, there's been definitely been a lot of games where I've struggled against the AI um, and been, like, slapped by them. There's been other games where I've done really well and won. And this game, I mean, so far I'm doing, I'm doing okay. But, yeah, I, I just don't know, though, how the player and team ratings come into play as well. Like, do they play too much of a part? I'm not too sure. We did have a smother before, Dan, yep. We did have a smother. I can't remember how I executed it, but um, it did It did do it. Oh. Left pace on top, bit of swing. Top of a peg, he's gone. Are you a lefty, are you? Left arm bowler? Yeah, I'm a left arm bowler. Right hand batsman, just to... Cause a bit of confusion. Drop punt looks good. Lynchy. A few heads will start to drop soon. Uh, Dale, I reckon there will be. I think there will be for Steam, um, but all the patches that come out over the weekend will end up on Sony on Monday. So, and just for those who have joined, that's not because people don't want you to have it. It's just because. Um, Sony don't operate on the weekend, so they've got to be able to process it. Uh, they've got to verify it and all that kind of shit, and then put it through. So that's that's where it's at. Oh, Catherine, are you dead to the same? Very good. I oh, wonder, smother. Thank you, thank you. It works well. It actually does cause quite a bit of confusion when you go out there to bat. There's been a couple of times where this is probably a bit of a dog act, but um, after having bowled for a little bit and had a couple of throws, they sort of realize you're a left-hander and I've gone out there and face gone to face up as a left-hand batsman so they've set the field accordingly because they just assumed left 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 um, and then yeah not long before the bowl is about to bowl switched around to the right stance and um, they had to readjust everything just to piss them off 19 and a goal good performance oh yeah the, the meatball absolutely uh, Sarge I think he's do we say he's back? I don't know. But I think I think he's had a good impact. And uh, Taranto again as well. Was it 12 tackles, 11 tackles, something like that? Um, I'm sure Kane Corns will think otherwise. But, I mean, he can only do so much, can't he? Oh, he's... Get it, Pickett. Oh, geez, where'd he come from? Ah, uh, to say Trent is not top, yeah, he's an idiot. He's just, he just, he does literally do it for clicks. And if you're his employer, you're loving what he's doing, unfortunately. Good handball chain. Oh, Dusty didn't complete the transaction though. Ah, uh, Hopper's been okay, I reckon. Oh, what was his injury though, Kane? That might have been what you're referring to. Apologies. My brother who hates Richmond texts me during the game. Yeah, well, we played four quarters, so that helped, Sarge. That definitely helped. First time. Oh, calf. What's that? Four to, four to six weeks. Breaks the line. They cannot keep I um I found it very interesting mark. tonight that Liam Jones was getting booed by Carlton fans because I know it's so hard because the the reasons surrounding his departure of the club weren't really as straightforward as someone you know leaving for money or 
doing the dirty in the club. It was very much his health and personal opinion uh, with the, the COVID stuff that is essentially why he wasn't playing. Yeah, I, I think he's within his right to do what he did because it's his body, his choice. Like, I, I don't think the Carlton fans really had a right... Uh, or, sorry, the Bulldog fans or whoever it was, they Carlton fans, yeah. Didn't have really a right to boo him. I thought that was a little bit harsh, to be honest. Because, yeah, I, I get it when, um, you know, if we look at Buddy, for example, leaving to take the big bucks from Hawthorne. I get that. Like, I'd be shitty at that as well. Um, but, yeah, for something like that, I mean, yeah. That's a good call, Sarge. Opportunities for Ross. I, I didn't think Ross did that well, though, on the weekend. I thought... He did okay, but I I felt like Good that the, the overall team Tickets game kind of masked his performance work. a little bit. Sonzi, I agree. I want him. Like I want him back. Samson Ryan, yeah. Well, that's right here, and like that's the thing. If he Mate, left for for the Blues at the start for Bolton, money Bolton, or whatever it might have been, Hopper, Gaps, then I think that's okay Bolton, to to you know boo someone for that. Takes the responsibility. Just needs to finish. Uh, he did, he did text, yep. Apparently Prestia said he didn't want him to. Um, didn't want fans to, but... Yeah, I mean, he, he's knocked Prestia into next week. So, I think I think we're entitled to hold a little bit of a grudge against him. Ah, uh, I couldn't catch him. Entirely my straight or cover dry. Oh, best in the league. It's a, it's a nice a feeling when you slap a cover drive. But they need to string some you just stand there. Don't even have to Matthew run. You just know it's racing to the boundary. Meter is too soft. Nothing with booing to put clothes off their game. The yeah, I think, look, down. the Horn Francis What's stuff I think is maybe going about? a little bit too far because to I, I understand why North people would do it. Off I think I'm okay with that because of how that all unfolded at the club. But in terms of... In terms of other teams, I don't really get why other clubs feel the need to boo him because he's not really done anything to them. I don't think. Didn't see the match. Uh, Stuart was booed because of an incident last was last year, the year before, where he um, cracked Prestia behind play and knocked him out cold. He got four or five weeks for it, but uh, yes, it really dicked us for the rest of the game because we didn't have Prestia playing. It was seemingly calculated, but poor fans boo text. Yeah, see, those those ones are different too, I reckon, huge. Like the showdowns, like when you've got Frio West Coast. Those, I think those things are okay. It's the randomness of, like like I said, the Horn Francis one. There's a little bit of, there's an element of randomness to that when it's teams not north. Loft the, yeah, I love the uh, loft down the ground, Jordan. Favourite shot. But to the your point, Free, um, we, we definitely can't be going down the path of not being Rocks allowed to boo or people being employed to police people right booing at games. Like, we can't be having that. Like, that's just crazy Inside talk, isn't it? Keen to get the ball moving. Ralph Smith at the end of the day, if you're paying money to go to the football, the booing isn't swearing, it's not racism, it's not... Oh, it's not likes. it's not the something that can be that you can say oh you know it's offensive it's just I think people right are entitled position. to boot but... oh you got you got a, mark, a speck in it was paid a mark that's awesome that must have been a good feeling the wood boat oh, it's definitely a sportsmanship a thing for sure I don't don't disagree with that at all he loves to run and carry. Thought his way through it. Come on, the G. Yeah, yeah, chuck it in there for sure. I want to see one that's been held. Do we know if there's a button combination for this Becky yet? Or is it still just the timing thing? For a second goal today, it'll have to weigh. He's missed. Oh, Coaches don't mind their missing everything. Themselves, but what did Eddie say, Sarge? Better option that time. Yeah, huge. I, I love the step passes. Some people have probably felt they're a little bit overpowered, uh, which I can I can understand, but I think it's necessary to have them, especially when you've got your Fords leading up at you. It's, it's so good. Oh, that was good, though. Get rid of it, Lynch. 
Nothing oh, holding the ball. But you've got to know your limits. Hold it for more. Starsevich. Uh, what did he say? He said, buddy thinks that... Right to press go. Oh, the that's a bit silly, Sarge, I think. Yeah. Cameron, good handball. Well played. His vision was excellent. It's hard, because player... I mean, if, if a player thinks that, they think that. We can't stop that, but... Yeah, it's just... It can go off on so many different tangents, can't it? The whole ball thing. I don't think anyone tipped it. Cox kicks seven. What's caught your eye, guess? The Tigers fully deserve their lead, and they've been... Your dad takes credit for your skill. That's what dads are for, taking credit for the skill. I've almost known on occasions what their opponents were going to do before they knew themselves. Thanks for those options. Yeah, it's an interesting take by Eddie Betts. Now it's someone else's problem. Bolton into the action again already. I mean, I will say, though, and I'm not saying that the booing's been racist by any stretch, but if anyone who's at the footy does hear racist stuff please oh there was a smother please call it out and get that shit stamped out asap there's definitely no place in the sport for it i'm just going to replay the smother so everyone can have a, a cheeky look I've only been twice okay so it's when you get to the contest yeah i thought it was something to do with that the um It was, this, it was over here, I think. The smother. There you go. Bit of a smother in there from here you go. <coughs> saw that coming. He's been <coughs> oh, shit. Hold the ball. That's holding the footy. Yeah, he, I, I he agree. It's, it's, it's too easy even out now, it, unfortunately. Yeah, the, the um, smother was pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. Good little dive across the ball. He's going for home. Oh, and he's jagged that. Like that. I'll do a play now game next, and we'll um, we'll check out the pies. Will not lie down. Good ruck work. Lions has brought his own ball. He doesn't waste many. Rainer, oh the clock is the enemy now. Bolter got a fist in. Look at him go. Oh. He might have done better. The Tigers have been caught on the hop. Wow, well, that's really unfortunate. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Discord is open to everyone. Uh, let me do this. Feel free. There's an AFL 23 section. There's normal AFL if you want to just chat about actual footy. General discussion. There's memes you can post about food, drink, the works, whatever you want. He stopped in his tracks. They might be a little Whatever you want. Not to be rewarded. It was a fine tackle. Um, there's a solid chance I haven't got a panel Nick for it. So you, you might be right there. Cotchen I need to get some new panels, I think. I made those ones myself on Canva. Bit of a half-assed job. Gradually getting bits, more bits and pieces added on the stream. Just got to keep chipping away at it. That's a strong mark. Oh, yeah. Now we're going to hit a target here. Probing ball. Reva can go Reva. Back and just I do. Oh, there we go. He's been striking them well. Oh, yeah, we'll check that as well, Jacko. Oh, yeah, we'll check. Didn't scroll two centimeters. <laughs> Goes at goal. Oh, Jesus. I missed that as well. I dodged a bullet there. They might not be so lucky next time. Yeah, Kane, I didn't see that coming necessarily pick it being forward i thought that was a, a very good move just from a, a pressure point of view really that's good vision we'll check bow i doubt it though trouble. i doubt it he's got under that one cameron ah see ah uh, see i still got to control ai to get Pushes over to that space. next kick there Kicking for his punch it over Time for the to go to work. that's handy spoil it through get for a point and reset you know, I never played AFL before. It's an easy game to get into. G'day, Bates. Welcome, first of all, to the Pink Pandas. Um, where are you, are you from overseas, are you? So this game came out on the 4th of May. Uh, it was meant to come out earlier, but got delayed. And then the launch was um, horrific, to say the least. The game bugs crashed the game. And so this isn't what the final product is still meant to be, from what we've been told. It's, um, there's definitely a lot of button combinations, but there probably is a, a big amount in FIFA as well, I suppose. For a three-goal game, it's there. Oh, straight up, very nice, welcome. 
It's um. It's definitely it's definitely more playable now than what it was. Like I said, there's a lot of modifiers to do stab passes and snapshots and things like that. And but once you sort of get used to all that and the tackling and running into position, it's yeah, it's not too bad. And there's still more tweaks and plenty more things coming. No, this is by Big Ant, which is a local developer here in Melbourne, and they've got a South Australian office too. Good question, Kane. Who do you think? I, I actually think that Samson Ryan's ruck work's been very good. I'm not saying that he'll come out, um, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know who's going to come out for him, but I think I almost prefer Samson Ryan in ruck at the moment. Highs. Pies versus Saints, Swans versus Dees, Cats versus Lions. Hopefully the Tigers get through. Goals haven't exactly flowed so far, so this would be valuable. But yeah, well, um, what, what do you play on? If you're playing on Steam, it, it's running okay. PlayStation users are seeing improvements and it feels all right. There is online gameplay, but it's really buggy at the moment. Like I tried to play before. I had a crack at playing three games and I wasn't able to hold connection with anyone for any of them, so I'm not sure if anyone else has had issues with that too. But there's also going to be a pro team mode as well, which will be very similar to like the ultimate team or my team structure. That's going to come out in a few weeks, I believe. You probably can, Kane, but will it make us too slow? I'm not sure. So as he categorically said he's right for next week, Alright, so we're going to check out... We're checking out the Bulldogs. There's a player in the Bulldogs. Academy. Uh, club. Artie Jones. Oh, no. Manage list. Uh, so, it, when it was released... The game was like fully built and ready to go, but the patch they used on day one crashed and just tore it to shreds. Um, and it pretty much got stripped right back to it before even the submission version. So it 100% wasn't planned and wasn't meant to happen that way. So they're just kind of rebuilding it gradually. Is that arty? Is that looking realistic? Miller out for Nank? Yeah, possibly. You're right, it could be Miller. Um, it's a hundred dollars, I think. You could pre-order it for seventy-four at JB, um, but I think it is now a hundred for most retail oh, on on Steam. Is anyway probably in JB. It's still going to be eighty, eighty-four, eighty-five dollars roughly. I reckon. Will the Adelaide Hill Ground be added? Uh, not sure. Is it used by VFL, AFL teams? Needs okay. It's just the hair's got to get fixed. We'll do a play now game and we'll use Collingwood so we can check out if Fly is in. And I'll check the Discord for the Spicky. Oh, I want to pick someone with a. Uh... No, I'm still not liking that. I'm thinking more of a kick clash at the Crows. That's probably not really that much better, is it, than Buddy? Oh, that's okay. Alright, so we'll see if we're crazy now. G'day, Gif, welcome. Yeah, the review... Oh, I was used for Gather Around Text. It should be in there at some stage. Okay, Mount Bark is coming. Thank you, AJ. Um, yeah, the reviews have been definitely... Started off very bad, and they'll probably justify it. A few people have edited and sort of started to change their mind a bit as the patches have come out. It's a long way back, though, to be fair, but um, we actually had Ross, the, de the CEO of the development company, he's actually popped into the stream the last couple of nights and answered some questions as well, which has been cool. Uh, Jonkers, Indigenous Gurndies are made, they're ready to go. They've just got to get approval from the artists, essentially. It's a, it's a lot more of a lengthy process to get approvals from the individual artists to get it into the game. So that's where, that's where that one's at. I appreciate that, Bates. Uh, so other games I play, usually play, play a bit of FIFA, NBA, Rust, 
Fall Guys, sometimes Fortnite, although I'm not overly great at Fortnite. Some would say I'm not overly great at a lot of games. Um, I'll probably be having a crack at Cricket 24. No, not a dumb question. Th no, this is uh, fully licensed by AFL, and this is the first time the AFL have had a huge part in the game, so they're actually like really supporting it, having a lot more hands on deck and getting really involved in it being as good of a football experience as it can. Uh, whereas previous years, they kind of... They knew it was there, obviously, and but didn't do much else, but they're really actively getting behind this one for the first time the in a, what battle. seems like it's going to be a semi-lengthy partnership, which is good, because you need to have the same developer for year on year to actually get somewhere. If you keep changing, it just turns to shit. Uh, play with... Yeah, I do... Absolutely, Dan. So play with viewers quite a lot. So even on games like Fall Guys, Fortnite, things like that, um, any games like that, if people want to join in and play, even this, once online's working and everyone's on crossplay and we can play, I'll definitely pick a few nights a week where we can, um, yeah, play against viewers, keep a leaderboard. Ultimately, I want to end up doing a tournament, but I want to wait until there's a few more features. So I support the Tigers. Is it GIF? GIF or Nerd? Who do you support? Out of the congestion, side bottom. Am I going that way? Can he hit a target? Yes, my check's down there. That's good. He's plucked it and should have a shot. Cricket 24 oh, sounds good. Kick, but that's easy to say from here. Yeah, uh, there's a lot of people who were, I suppose, a bit torn about uh, Cricket 22. I've not played cricket games since Shane Warne Cricket, so I think it's meant to come out early June or mid June or something. So I've got to have a look. There's meant to, I'm assuming there's going to be, there'll be a trailer coming of some kind. How to sign free agents. Um, I've not done that myself. I, I remember sitting the season where getting to like the draft point, the rookie draft, nab draft. Oh, there's a specky. But it's play on. No, I didn't play on. That's annoying. I was going to get the cricket game if I win a giveaway or it becomes free. <laughs> Oh, I support Collingwood, okay. Why the pies? Uh, why do I think games that are Aussie sports fail? I think... I think it's largely because there's not a, a wide enough um, supporter base. Like, these games are obviously only really going to be of interest to mainly Australians or expats who are now offshore. So the market isn't global at all. So it probably then doesn't allow developers to get the amount of sales needed to keep chucking big coin into the game like what you see for FIFA and 2K being it like them being global games they obviously get more funding more purchases uh, which then allows them to create more things for us but um, AFL being a, a local game you just you don't get that so that's where it's a little bit tricky I guess cricket's probably heading down the path of getting more global recognition I think I think they signed up India as part of uh, another nation to be in their game, which will be yeah, which will be huge, like given how sort of cricket savvy Indians are. They, they love their cricket. That's not a good kick. That could happen, member. That is a distinct possibility. Collingwood winning the flag and Dacos winning the Brownlow. Ah. Uh, I'll go for Richmond. Go for the Tigers. Uh, William, welcome. Um, oh, as I run the Ruckman way out of position. I wait for the vibration. So that was in one of the updates recently. They added like the, the vibration in for the marking timing. So when I feel it vibrate, that's when I hit triangle. And it gives me the, the best chance possible, I suppose. How good last night. I know, Rory. I know. Um, it was, it was, yeah, it was pretty good. Unexpected. Unexpected. At the risk of this being a dark question, and apologies if it's a silly one. Are you the Rory Hilton who played for the Tigers or just got the same name or same username? It's a hot footy. The Vibration Lifesaver? Absolutely. Same name. Okay, cool. He was a good player, Rory. I didn't mind him. But no. Uh, did not expect to win that game, must be said. Uh, for EPL, I follow Tottenham in the EPL. 
Seize an opportunity and play I used to follow it more closely when Fox still had the rights. Like ever since Optus have had it, I've really not been able to watch it because I'm not an Optus customer. So, uh, which is annoying because, I mean, I'm sure everyone remembers with who's had Fox sell where it'd get to like Saturday night or whatever. You'd press red and you'd have bloody ten screens up of all the different soccer games on that you could pick from to watch and just flip between them all. Like that was living the dream at like 11:30 to one o'clock in the morning. It's awesome. But since it's been with Optus, not so much love. Imagine if Dacos... Oh, yeah, if he can do that in his second year, that would be... Um, it's not that far-fetched. Like, if people don't start tagging him... Who have the pies got tomorrow? Surely Kane Corns gets the middle finger celebration for his protein card. It's time for some observations from Gary Lyons. Crows were slow out of the blocks and they're already playing. Okay, backup. so still no fly. We've still got the bald McCray. And a good Richmond and Tottenham, you poor soul. Well, look, it for a while there, drunk as it wasn't sure pretty, was it? Tottenham haven't exactly filled a trophy cabinet Thanks, with much. Uh, and for most of my lifetime, the Tigers had neither. So things are looking pretty grim until 2017. And then, um, yeah, we obviously had a little bit of success, which was good. I think Tottenham's biggest mistake in recent times has been sacking Pochettino. I still think that was just stupid. He's generally a good kid. But um, not that I know. You can see their confidence growing. Well, he actually had the team playing well, full of dust. I know. The amount of shit I cop from that still. The trophy cabinet, all the memes and stuff to get around. Fox are losing soccer is a joke. Soccer is number one sport. Yeah, I know. I know. It's bullshit. Like, that honestly killed it for me. Like, I would legitimately watch Tottenham almost every week. And I would watch other games as well. Like I said, you bring up all the other games and just sit there and watch it. Um, so, yeah, Optus... Like, I didn't, I didn't really feel like I could justify changing... Like, phone provider, essentially, and paying on a bigger plan just to be able to watch the soccer. Hey, because I don't think you can... I don't even think you can add it. You can just buy it. Just buy that. As a non Optus customer, you have to actually be on their phone plan, I think. It's that even worse. Yeah, so people who, who were already on Optus are obviously in a good spot with getting it for free already as part of their plan, but I just feel like it really, yeah, really limited what people could watch, which is annoying. What? How was that out of play? Pretty sure. Okay, see like that one. That's okay. G'day, Junkers. Did I miss something of yours? Hang on, I just want to see what happened here. They've said out. They've. So I don't know why we've got a bounty throw in here. Which is making goals very hard to come by. Oh yeah. Cameron. Look at the distance on that hand pass. Side bottom. How? So that's a good handball chain from defence. McStay takes a beauty. McStay. Brother had an Optus phone. Oh, it stayed active. Yeah, that's awesome. Uh, hang on, I'll read that in a sec. Last night the ball went touch. Touch behind, straight through the goal. It was, yeah, I, same thing just happened there pretty much. What the hell is that? You had a tackle be called run too far. <laughs> yeah, there's a couple of weird decisions. I think it's fucked these games aren't at pubs. Yeah, live any Fox will drop the ball. I know, and like, if it honestly wasn't for the sports side of things for Foxtel... I would have no purpose for it. Uh, well, to be fair, the only reason why I've probably still got Foxtel and haven't just gone to KO for sports is because my wife does like watching a lot of other random shows like the, like the Kardashians and all these dance mum type crazy shows so that you, I'm sure they're probably on other streaming services, but um, yeah, it's, a, it's essentially now cheaper to get all these individual streaming services um, like your KO and binge, prime, all that kind of stuff, and then 
without you, you don't you don't pay the same price as Foxtel. Oh, 100 percent. You like being a pirate? What are you a pirate there, Dan? And you know what the worst part is, Bates. And I'm really shit at these phone calls. But when you see um, all these new fancy offers that Foxtel are putting in, or Telstra, or whatever the company is, and you're already an existing customer, and you can't even get access to it, you ring up, you're like, oh, well, I want to get my plan changed. Can I be on the deal that you're offering new customers? Oh, no, sorry, mate. That's only for anyone who just signs up. It's like, well, hang on. How about rewarding the people who have been with you for 10 years, paying their bills every month, and give them a better plan? Who have the pies got, Brody? Uh, William, I was playing a game online with my friends, down by five, had a kick after the siren. Oh, no, and it crashed as it went. Wow. Yeah, that shit. Did you punch your TV? I, I would have probably thrown a control at that. Uh, Pies could definitely win by... Uh, 70 might be a bit much. I reckon by 35 to 45 tomorrow for the Pies. Just had another Specky. I'm so jealous. That's so good. Pirate Bay is the OG spot to dock at. <laughs> yeah, no loyalty in Foxtel. 100%. And like... I've... Um, I've been on their live chat, had phone calls, trying to, you know, do the, I'll, I'll, I'll cancel, I'll cancel. But I've never been able to, like, sell it well enough to, for them to be like, oh, yeah, we'll, we'll give it, we'll give you whatever. I've just been shit at it. Uh, not a, I've gotten better with my negotiation skills, but, yeah. Getting lag. I've noticed a couple of lag, like, watching it on the stream, Rhino, but playing has been okay. Although online, I've not been able to get a game at all. It's just... Uh, dropped out every single time. Uh, Prime, I, I this I, I understand this may come across as controversial, but I really enjoy the whole KSI, Logan Paul, Jake Paul. I enjoy the whole thing. I think it's it's hard not to respect what they've done. They have they have put themselves on the map in a huge way, and whether people like them or hate them is almost irrelevant. With the amount of revenue they've generated for themselves. Um, is it tomorrow he fights, is it? And, like, I I'm sure there's larger storylines at play here that it is all being mapped out behind the scenes for a big ultimate showdown with Jake and KSI. Uh, but even, like, Tommy Fury getting involved as well. I just think they're, they're very good at their talking game, um, and it just makes things a bit more interesting. Like, it, it, it honestly, I've watched all of their fights that they've all had, and I would probably not watch many fights otherwise, so it, it, it's definitely sucked me into it. Uh, and even to the point where you know I'm trying to get my hands on buddy bottles of prime. So I think I think they've been they've been very clever in how they've gone about it all. No, no, ruthless. Welcome, bro. The game's trash. Refunded day one. Hey, I don't chase you. Uh, well, I mean, you're right. Day one, you are right that it was trash, and you, they didn't chase you. But it's been substantially changed since then. So. I mean, each to their own if you were going to re-get it again or whatnot. But you're right, for, on day one, you could run the whole field and no one would touch you. But that doesn't happen anymore. Categorically does not happen anymore. Is that right, Danny? We've got the same specs. That's pretty cool. I I had a bit of a help helping hand from uh, the sock puppet who's the PC connoisseur out of our group of friends. He built it for me. Um... It was obviously, we could build a better PC for the same price. Like, say, I think the budget we had, like, two and a half grand, for example, let's say. Uh, if we were to buy a pre-made build at two and a half grand, it would be a lot less spec than what it would be if you built it. So that's, uh, yeah, why we did that. Uh, this particular patch, Josh, it says it's meant to have better handball chain smothering is definitely in. I've had that a couple of times, which has been kind of cool. Um... But for me, it's been the two patches before that where the movement's been a bit better that's been the most help. Some, sometimes it's still a bit janky in certain aspects, but definitely better overall. Speckies are in the game as well now. Um, I've not been able to... I've looked like I've marked a couple, but it's been play on. Uh, I'll thank you for the follow, Spino. But um, that wood bloke has been marking the Speckies. Is that three now? He's off. Time to measure the kick. Dawson marks in the back pocket. Murray. Oh, good tackle. Low. Goal kicking is now harder as well, which is good. 
I don't think he meant to smoke. Well, I say that in a 60 and this probably isn't a great game to reference that, but the um, the timing meter now, you've got to actually get right. Otherwise, you won't score. What's he got on offer? Side bottom is always Ah, side bottom. The player that Richmond never tagged. Four now. Jesus. Personally, I really like the game. Enjoy. Just need to be harder. Yeah, yeah. And I think they've said that the difficulties are getting bumped up a bit in the coming days. And the crashes, it's such... Like, I, I agree. The hard part is, I, I feel like there's a little bit of expectation from people that when they see on the patch notes that it's improved stability and crashes, that it means it's their one. But unfortunately, there's so many variations of crashes and things that trigger it that just because it's in the patch notes for one day doesn't doesn't always mean it's your your type of crash that they're fixed, unfortunately, uh, which is really annoying. But all you can do is keep reporting it, um, so they get so they get it sent through to them, and they can try and rebuild it and um, get it fixed. Uh, these this update won't come through to Sony until Monday, so Sony will get a, a batch of about three all in one. Because there'll be another another patch tomorrow, I dare say. Oh, I, why did I punch it to him for? What an idiot. Yeah, and that, that would be annoying, buds. And I 100% agree and, and feel for people who are getting the same crashes over and over. Um, you know, because you paid your money to play it, to play a game that you can actually play. And it's, it's not giving you much love. But hopefully they can get all the, all the crashes ironed out. I reckon we're a good chance, William, but it's a consistency thing. Like, it's all good and well to beat you long in a four-quarter game, but if you don't turn up the next week, it's almost worth nothing. If, a very big if at this moment, if we still think we can play finals, we have to beat them. Um, but then, like, you know, you look back a couple of weeks prior, we lost to the bloody Gold Coast, so who knows what's going to happen. Ritual management mode... Yeah, Josh, I'm, I'm probably like I know I have played management games, but it's more to test how all the different modes are handling with like bugs and crashes and things like that. Um, I won't go too balls deep into it. I'll start a brand new management career once everything's up to really good level, and do all the drafting and stuff like that. I don't want to go too into it yet. Games of Shams release. Yeah, exactly, bud. Exactly. And, like, I know people are still going to be a bit torched by and feel a bit aggrieved by what happened, and that's fair enough. They're, they're allowed to feel that way because it, it didn't go well at all. Um, but, you know, all Big Ant can do is do their best to rectify it as quickly as possible. That's their obligation to us because of how it launched. And I think at this stage, they're, you know, holding up to their end of the bargain on that front. Um, but obviously, we would have much rather not been in the situation to start with, but... You know, we can't change that now. It is, is what it is. You know, they're obviously working big hours. Um, and for all the all the hate that Ross has copped and being Anne of Cops for how it's gone, he's still fronting up in a public space on the forums. He's coming into this stream every now and then to answer questions. Like They're not hiding from it. They're actually copping on the chin and trying to do something about it. So that's good. That's good. Yeah, no, I, I can understand that thought process, not the $100 price tag. Oh, really? Limited modes, yeah. Well, I think Steam's actually the most expensive at the moment. I think, though, if you were to hold off for another week and a half, two weeks, um, I think you'll find it will be a more complete game and it might feel a bit better for you. Oh, very good, Dylan. Why is Crows vs. Port Magpies playing at the MCG? Very good. Well done. <laughs> we wanted to see if uh, Craig McRae was in. I should have gone the proper prison bars, shouldn't I? G'day, Ben. Going well yourself? Ben, welcome. Oh, you jinxed it, bud. It does until it happens in a really important moment. Uh, the patch is okay. The The biggest noticeable difference has been that I've seen a couple of smothers happen, which has been pretty cool. Um, so that's been nice. The speckies are in, but I've I've had the animation that I've taken a specky, but I've not been paid the mark. But other people are having more luck than me on that, where it's being paid, which is good. Leeds manager got pushed by a fan. Whereabouts? At the ground or outside the ground? I appreciate that, Dylan, with the TikToks. 
I've always been a bit unsure how the TikToks land. Like, I'm just trying to provide information for people so, you know, they can see the patch updates and do whatever they want. But, no, that's, that's good. I appreciate that. I'm going well, thanks, Bang. Big day at work, was it? I'm actually tired myself, and I've got a big day tomorrow, so I don't know how much longer I'll last, but... I agree, but I would rather it crash earlier than late. Uh, Josh, a majority of this week's patch is going to be visuals. Uh, if I was to guess, Josh, this is purely a guess, I would say that type of stuff will come later. I think they're really focusing on gameplay and the crashing aspect first, because when you think about it, there's no point if they put the cheer squads at the right end or putting gold patches on jumpers if the game's unplayable. Because it, it'll be all for nothing if we can't actually play the game properly. So, um, and that's just purely my view. I don't know anything on that at all. But um, to me, it makes more sense to get the gameplay piece right so we can all play the game properly and then get all the cosmetic stuff in there back to where it should be. I get the annoyance, though, um, for sure. And, and they do as well. But I just think if we're talking about a priority list, that's probably on the lower end at the moment but it will come it will come ai movement yeah i saw that too ben i don't i don't actually know i haven't felt it be much different i would i said before i would like to know what that actually meant like in what capacity was the ai movement better just so you can use it as a reference point so i'm not too sure big one working tomorrow 11 till 3 then go into the footy after dinner for mother's day oh that's good Nothing wrong with ambition, but you've hey, got was that going to the footy on Mother's Day? Very nice. It's been that kind of day for you reckon the pies will go all right? Into the In the technical goes. area. Oh, wow. Surely the fans get banned for life for that Dawson. kind of shit. You can't be pushing the coach. I have found, though, that EPL no short options, so is very cutthroat with their the managers, line. aren't they? Spud like... Brawley the amount of managers that have gotten a gig and then, you know, had a run of maybe seven or eight bad games and then bang, gone, see you later. It's just brutal. Like I said, Tottenham, we were dumb enough to get rid of Pochettino after he really got the team in a good spot and then... Yeah, I, I always felt like we weren't even giving him the money to spend on plays that he wanted, but yet sacked him. Oh, I know, Dan. And hard to fathom it ever happening in the AFL. What, a hand pass. Smith. what about, what's everyone's thoughts on in terms of player movement in the AFL versus the other sports around the, the world? So what I mean by that is, like, you look at baseball, for example, or even NFL, where if a player wants to leave the club, they can, but the club sends them to the place where they're getting the best deal. So they might be playing in New York today, half-time of the games, like, oh, sorry, mate, you're actually going to, uh, to Dallas, pack your bags, we've uh, offloaded you. No worries, Bang. Thanks for stopping by. Hopefully you had a good day tomorrow. Couldn't keep it in. It'll be tossed back. I appreciate the support. But yeah, I've I've always been a big thing on with the AFL I'm talking about. Good that if work. a player wants Handle. to be this traded and they're still in Turn contract, the they should not have the power to nominate a club. It should just be the club Look goes, Yep, yeah, if you want to trade, that's fine, but you're going to where we can get the best deal. If they're out of contract, fair enough. Like that's you know, they can kind of have, have a bit of a say there. But, yeah, if you're in contract and you tell the club, I want to leave, you should have close to zero say in where you go. It should be all up to the club. But the problem is the Players Association has too much say in it. And the, don't get me wrong, the Players Association has been good overall. But for something like that, I think it's just batshit crazy that clubs get bent over when they've when they've got a contracted player who wants to leave and they've still got a they've still got a fork out for their needs, it's just stupid. Uh oh, Josh, it would be nice if we can get onto a winning streak. We desperately need to. Um, I'm gonna try an online game again and if it doesn't work, we'll wrap it up I reckon. But um, yeah the Tigers Look, in this block of four games, I always had allowed us to lose to Geelong. I thought that was okay to lose that if we were to beat Gold Coast, West Coast, and there was someone else who we were playing. And then we lose to Gold Coast. Like, oh, well, shit. We need to pick up another win somewhere. And we managed to knock off Geelong. So who knows what we're doing. Are they going to add a chip kick over the, to get over the top 
Oh, I don't know, Jacko. Just like a little quick, yeah, quick little trip. Oh, that's a good call. I'd like to have a quicker, a quicker snap at goal as well inside 50. Like, it's really hard. Like, you might win the tap down to your player, but it's, it's almost impossible to actually get that shot on goal away, which would be good. Who watched the power thump? What was the final margin then? No, what was in the score? I, I saw that the power were doing okay early, but I didn't actually catch the end of it. Seventy points, Jesus! God damn. Wow, one hundred thirty-five. Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling a bit of a mixed bag, Josh, with the set shot. Sometimes they go through easy. Sometimes the um, timing bar, I completely botch it. There's going to be more, like, wind will come into play soon as well, so it should make it harder again. Hi, g'day, Milkman. Welcome. Horn Francis for the win. The patch notes for tonight, as we're trying to find an online game, the patch notes were added smothers, which look pretty cool, improved handball on the run, improved AI positioning, improvements to various UI elements. Uh, the AI positioning, I'm a little bit unsure if it's done anything or if it works, because I'm not sure in what context. Um, they were implementing that in. The handball on the run, I'm finding hard to tell as well because I'd, I haven't had that many issues with it previously. Um, so it still works fine for me. Sometimes it goes a bit skewy if like it goes out of bounds or whatever, which I hope they fix. But yeah, I haven't noticed too much of a difference. Smothers are definitely the big one though. Greek Freak, welcome. Um... And Speckies are in, the, are in the game too. Speckies are in the game. Hasn't let me hold a mark yet though, but uh, it's in there. Okay, Kermit, I don't know if there's a button per se to Specky. I think, <clears throat> I think it's more about timing. Yeah, like I said, I've, um, I've had the animation where I've marked it, but it's not actually been paid a mark has been a bit sucky there will be a training wave coming yep yep there definitely will be so there was on the launch party night there was a training section in that menu but uh i didn't see it at the submission build one or obviously the, the game that's launched so that is still to come uh, i think we've been told since it's since april 23 release richmond can't lose <laughs> that's a good correlation josh you're right though isn't it two weeks we did look a bit ugly in the first quarter of that west coast game though must be said i was a little bit nervous after that and then we finally got our shit together and it was one of those things you, you really didn't know how much to take out of it but uh obviously we could take a little bit g'day jack welcome i i have had a couple of speckies they haven't been paid as marks though so a few other people a few other viewers have been paid marks which is good Mine, as soon as I've hit the ground, have been called play on for some strange reason. So I'm not sure if it's a timing thing for me. No, nah, no subs tonight, Milkman. So no one's had the chance at the gold star. If anyone does sub there, they will get the chance. Whether it's uh, prime or otherwise, you'll get the chance with the goldie. AFL bug. 9,000%. What difficulty you got it on, Kermit? What are you winning by? Like 500 points a game. All systems go Jesus. What should be a beauty. Take your foot off the gas, lead into English finals, give the players the a rest. Contest, Pendlebury, what can he manufacture? The aerialist will battle for this ball. Hoskin oh. Elliott gets to the front spot. They're still not changing players. Sometimes it does change players off the market, run, other times it doesn't. So that's a little bit pass. annoying. Takes the responsibility. Just needs to finish. Finish he does. On hard, wow. So what what score line are you, and how long are your quarters? English showing his skills. Chris, he set upon, had some assistance. Hoskin Elliott, oh he's so gosh. good in close. Side bottom, leaves them in his way. He's already got one. Now he's got two. Seriously, this feels like I'm watching a Richmond game all over. There's no one on side bottom. Five minutes, is that all? When I played as, that's crazy, Kermit. Would not say Rosie. Oh, why? G'day, Twisted Crow. Welcome. Hot pies. Yeah, but I'm not liking the look of this, though. 
Online is still cooked. The bounce button's still not working. Yeah, I'm I'm not a huge fan of it being the left thumb button. I'm able to, just, to replay this shot over and over. Like, that's why I'm th I was thinking of getting, like, an Xbox Elite controller and actually... I would map it to one of the paddle buttons at the back, I reckon, if I was able to choose. Disconnected. That's so shit. Like, that's the furthest I've got in, like, five attempts to play an online game. No worries, Jacko. All good, mate. Thank you for stopping by. Much appreciated. Appreciate the support. I'm going to try once more to play an online game, and if it doesn't work, I'm going to bed. Got to, and like this is what I was saying before about the online part is twisted for sure. Offline, I think the offline's actually okay. There's still obviously a lot they can improve on and, and make better for sure. But in terms of bugs, it's it's actually not too bad the other modes. But the online, um, it is really struggling, and I actually feel like it's gotten worse, which is annoying because I I'm a massive online player, like all FIFA, NBA. We're always playing pro teams and pro-am on the my park and shit like that. Um, I've not really ever been a career player, so it's a bit frustrating for me that I can't play online. And I don't know, and Ross had mentioned that some of it could be because I'm doing, I'm streaming and trying to play at the same time, maybe because it's PVP, it's not server-based. So I don't know if my own internet stuff's playing an issue as well, but no worries. Greek Freak, thank you for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Appreciate all the support and dropping in. Coming from the six-hour stream. Jesus. Dedication to the calls. Is there a way in management mode to see how many weeks? Well, I'm not sure, Josh. I actually... I can't recall a player being injured for me yet. I've not ever really checked. Has anyone else had any experience in that? Yeah, not down. too sure. Let's see if we can get a bit further at this time Gorn around. Wins the first rack contest. Brayshaw. There goes the kick inside the fifty. Pickett. Dangerous to leave on his own. That should be see, Greek Freak. Goal. Thank you so much for stopping by again. Really appreciate it. Hope you have a good day tomorrow. Drop punt, and he has on the board. Five. Get him in a snapper, Hammy. <laughs> oh, Ginny. Yeah, I follow the Celtics, Dylan. So, big game on Monday against the 76ers. Although we shouldn't... We should have had this wrapped up earlier. Like we lost the game in overtime by a point, which wasn't very helpful. Just need Tatum to shoot the lights out. He did dick all for three quarters the other day. Uh, but to his credit, he kept taking his shots in the last, and he actually hit, I think, two or three three-pointers in a row that actually got us out ahead, uh, which was good. Thinking of creating my own podcast. Any advice? Um, I, I'll get, come back to that text, man. Thank you, Nuru. Much appreciated. Thanks for jumping on. No, all good. Happy to give feedback, you know, and I'll call it how it is. If there's shit that needs to improve, we'll absolutely call that as it is, so... Uh, but yeah, I reckon in a, if you leave it for another week and a bit, I reckon if you pick the game up then it'll be feeling a lot more complete. So, uh, in terms of doing a podcast, Tex, I I say go for it um, because or what to depends on what topic it's going to be, I suppose. But if you're going to have guests, if it's just going to be yourself. So the podcast I do is a Richmond-based podcast, so it's obviously very niche and very... It was very hard to grow because there was already the official club one and a couple of other fan-based ones. Uh, but we've been going for seven years and we're, you know, we're at, what, 700 and something subscribers on YouTube, two and a half thousand on Twitter and so on and so on. Um, so it can be done. you just got to have, I suppose, dedication to it. Um, you know, if it's a sport-related one, make sure you put your research in so you know what you're talking about. Um, I don't do I don't do any editing at all. So if people say the wrong thing or they have a blooper, they make a bad joke, whatever it might be, I leave it all in because to me it adds to the experience. It just makes it feel a bit more personable. 
there's no point trying to make everything early days i tried to edit it to perfection within an inch of its life um but it just it come across too forced and too it just sounds shit so my boy show yeah the nuggets come out to play dylan they, uh, they were unbelievable um this is gonna freeze again this is really shit Jordan, uh, the stars would be who I would follow, but um, I was probably more more on the back of uh, Glenn Maxwell more than anything. I like Maxi, and um, yeah, my mum worked with his mum, so there's a bit more of a, a close connection there. Who do you follow for the BBL? Yeah, Milkman Online is has shit the bed in a big way tonight, which is not good. Very annoying, but um, they need to fix that because I I miss my online play. So that's yeah, that's super shit. All right, we will find we will find someone to raid. Hopefully, there's someone else playing. Find AFL someone to raid. Hopefully, there's oh, someone else playing. I find AFL someone to raid. Hopefully, there's oh. don't want that happening. Jesus Christ. AFL twenty three. Oh, if it's Lakers versus Celtics, my goodness, that would be that would bring the house down. My only problem with that, though, is LeBron LeBron will go full LeBron and um, absolutely torture us. It's just what he does. Okay, he's not happy about the Zamper and Harper. Oh, okay. All aboard the cane train. Any danger of Twitch loading? Oh, there we go. Maybe it was just my internet. No, there is no one else playing. Oh, well. Need to fix tackling. I can run the whole field. Oh, yeah, they are. They are fixing that, Reggie. I played against someone online the other night, um, and he did exactly that to me, and Ross was like, yeah, we've got to nerf that. So they are well aware of that one. Yeah, Dylan, that was funny, wasn't it? That that post-game presser. Where <laughs> you you got to love his confidence. Um but yeah, to, to, to say that then was was pretty astounding. But uh, all right, guys, we're going to call it a night there. Thank you so much for everyone's love and support. Appreciate all the, the chat, the feedback, talking about all kinds of sports. That's what we're all about. Make sure if you want to keep talking about sports, feel free to jump into the Discord. If you like, there's, yeah, we can talk about whatever we want in there. I'll drop the link there if anyone wants it. Oh, Discord, what a dickhead. Discord. How embarrassing is that? Um, yeah, feel free to jump in. Uh, if anyone's on YouTube as well, any support on YouTube is appreciated as well with the videos there. TikTok, I know a lot of you are here from TikTok, which is really cool. But other than that, have a good day tomorrow uh, for Mother's Day. If anyone's doing anything, good luck. Hope it all goes well. Have a great night. I don't think I'll be streaming tomorrow, but um, hopefully I might squeeze one or two in next week before we go on holiday. So there will be about a week's a week period where there'll be no streams because I'm going away, unless I do an IRL stream uh potentially but probably less likely because i only be on my phone but we'll see how we go but um have a good night everybody stay safe and i'll speak to you soon go tigers